Uh, and now over to Lukas Kogut. Thank you very much. Thank you for the floor. It's always difficult to speak after Prime Minister. Uh, dear colleagues, uh, the EU and uh, Norway have uh, many common points. Uh, one of them is the same approach concerning values such as democracy, equality uh, and the rule of law. Democratic funds should not help the authoritarian regimes. However, it, it is highly important to distinguish civil society and an authoritarian government, Polish society and peace party, Fidesz and Hungarian society. At the beginning of, the, uh, of this European Parliament term, I work as a shadow reporter on uh, the Citizens Equality Rights and Values uh, program. This is um, a unique instrument in order to support civil society, disposing of almost 1.5 uh, billion euros. What is crucial, the instrument provides legal opportunity to enhance civil society acto uh, actors directly. Maintaining support for this uh, organization, citizen, is particularly in the interests of democratic countries. To conclude, disagree with the politicization of justice as well, support for liberal values and protest against discrimination of the LGBT community. These points are inseparably concerned to Polish civil society and dem democratic communities in Europe, and we will never let these values be dismissed by an democratic power. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, uh, Lukas. And now I would give the floor to Lukas Kogut. Well, yes, it is very important what uh, uh, Ina Eriksson have just said. Um, as I mentioned before, uh, I think the most important thing uh, is to find some kind of uh, bridge between uh, pro-democratic civil society and funds without uh, authoritarian and I'm not afraid of using these words, uh, governments in, in Poland and uh, Hungary. Uh, between 2010 and 2012, uh, I was a coordinator uh, of one of EAA grants uh, between uh, two schools, uh, one in Norway, one in Poland, uh, the Rybnik and Os Videgorende School in Norway. And it was a very fruitful cooperation for, for both sides. So please consider the same mechanism uh, as, as uh, this used in this uh, citizens' equality, rights and values. Uh, program that we uh, uh, that we established here in the European Parliament. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, uh, Lukas Kogut.